When pizzeria integrations, the method of integration is extremely important. Uh, let me break it down between differences between HL7 and Fires as an example. Uh, you're going to need to connect with a variety of systems. You need information on, you know, admit, discharge, transfer, ADT, uh, you know, information. You need to connect to the EHR to get, you know, active patient status. You need connections with the lab system to understand labs. All these different systems. Uh, you know, the average hospital has 10 to 15 key information systems that are all part of this uh, you know, diaspora of information. Now, when you're integrating, if you're using HL7, each one of those is a distinct integration and it will be a distinct project. Uh, typically 40 hours per direction for HL7, let's say, to establish that. Uh, that quickly adds up. But let's say you just connect with five systems, inbound and outbound. Uh, that's 400 hours uh, of, of work right there based on 40 per direction. With newer integration standards like FHIRE, you're able to oftentimes access all of those systems, all of the relevant information that you need to get to with a single project, with a single connection. Um, so rather than being a 400 hour intense specification review and everything that goes into that, uh, it's one project. It's a 20 to 50 hour project. If you're going to connect via HL7 Fire, whichever standard uh, with these systems, don't do it multiple times if you have multiple service lines or multiple products. Like integrate once, drive value across the spectrum. Leverage that single integration point to drive all of those connections, all of those workflows, uh, you know, all, all the way. Having the AI operating system is a great opportunity to centralize all of those capabilities. Uh, if you're going to integrate with the EHR, do it once, leverage it wisely, power multiple workflows. If you're gonna integrate with scheduling, to have a better understanding of who's actually working with patients at that moment in time, same thing. Uh, so being able to apply multiple workflows, multiple uh, streams of engagement with patients using that single connected AI operating system uh, simplifies the entire adoption of new clinical protocols, of new workflows that your institution is really interested in trying, uh, but going to have to go through a lot of education effort to do without technology.